Welcome back to my channel. This is my haul this week. I'm gonna make salads. It's really hot outside, so I've been wanting things like salad and fruit. So I'm gonna go ahead and use up some of the greens that I already have that I didn't use up with my burgers last week and make some salads. So to go with that, I already had the greens. They're in the fridge. I bought the blackened chicken strips. Those are my favorite for salads. I did buy some light Northern Italian dressing. This is two points for two tablespoons. Normally for salads, I just like olive oil and lemon, but I am trying to cut down on the calories and points because my weight's been kind of staying the same for about a month. I haven't lost anything. So we'll see if really watching the points, the calories will kind of kickstart it again. I've lost a total of 40 since I started last year. And well, since I got serious last year, I've technically was trying for a lot longer, but, but I've since lost about 40. So I wanna keep that going and not lose momentum. So I bought the light dressing, two points per two tablespoons, which should be plenty. Bought some tomatoes to go with that. They didn't have a lot of variety at Safeway this morning, but these are the ones that I picked. I got some mozzarella. These aren't the pearls, but they're kind of like the pearls are just a little bit bigger. So I'll have that as my cheese. And I already have a cucumber and I think that's all I need for the salad, but I'll show you when I make it, everything that I put in it. I bought an Olipop. I didn't like the cherry Olipop that I tried, but I really liked the orange flavored poppy. They didn't have poppy at Safeway, but they did have Olipop. So I thought I would try one of these. Maybe I'll like a different flavor of Olipop. I bought these as a snack. These are just some tomato and basil crunchy snacks made from red lentils. So I'll give these a try and see. I could technically eat the whole bag for 10 points, but I'll try not to do that. <laughs> and I've got some bell pepper that I'm getting. I've been loving just having fresh bell pepper as a snack. I did get the organic this time. I don't always get organic, but the variety of organic was just so much better than the ones that they had for the conventional. So this time I felt like it was worth it. So I got a red and a yellow and I did buy these. I bought these at Whole Foods. I got some black plums. I guess they're called black plums. A plumot. <laughs> A black plumot. Okay. Got some strawberries. Got some cherries from Trader Joe's. As you can see, I've halfway finished these. I bought these a couple days ago. But I just want to show you, I do run into the store and buy fresh fruit. And I have three apricots left that I bought as well at Trader Joe's. So just wanted to show you, cause I know I say I run into the store and I buy fruit. Cause sometimes I like to get it at Trader Joe's or Whole Foods better than like Safeway. But that's what I got this week. So stay tuned to see how I put all this together and don't forget to like and subscribe. I'm gonna try to use up some of this this week. I'm gonna make salads and then have some of my leftovers. So I'm gonna pull out this tortellini. This is the chicken tortellini I made a few weeks ago. I've got quite a few saved of that. So I'll pull those out. So I'll have four of those. And that'll be one of my meals. And then I'm gonna make salads to supplement because it's really hot. I'm not wanting to cook a lot. So for the next few weeks, we'll be using up leftovers and trying to get this to a more manageable amount of food. <laughs> So 
So getting everything ready for my salads, I'm gonna put this blackened chicken in the air fryer and cook it according to the instructions. And I just try to put about two servings worth so I can get two salads worth of chicken. And this blackened chicken is only zero points. I've got the red leaf lettuce. I ended up only having enough for one salad. Some of it had frozen in the back of my fridge, so it wasn't any good. I tossed it out. But what I could salvage, I put in my container for one salad. I really love adding this mozzarella to the salad. It just makes it feel kind of fancy. But I like to cut the little pearls in half because it just stretches it a little bit. So if you're on a weight loss journey and you don't want to add more cheese, you can kind of get the effect of more cheese by cutting the pieces in half. And I just slice my tomatoes in half. I just find they're easier to bite into when they're about that size. And it helps them to match the size of the mozzarella. And I like to add the cucumber in the bottom part of the container with the greens because it just saves space on the top so I can add other things. I like to add something for crunch to my salads. This is some nuts, some well, some seeds. These are pepitas, I think, or pumpkin seeds. And then sometimes I'll add croutons. I'll keep them separate though. I don't let them mix with the lettuce because they'll get soggy. This is the dressing I use this time. And I just guessed that it was about two tablespoons and it really adds something nice to the salad. I really am happy with this dressing even though it's light. I'm also using up leftovers, so I took those containers of chicken tortellini out of the freezer. And I'm going to use up these carrots that I had. I bought them to snack on, but they're just a little bitter. But I think if I cook them up, if I saute them with the zucchini and squash, it'll bring out the sweetness. And I cut some, some of the skin off of the squash because it was looking kind of brown. And the zucchini still looked good. This is leftover from last week because I bought too much, so I'm going to use it this week. I'm adding a generous amount of olive oil, but I'm not gonna count it because it's just for veggies and it's a healthy fat. And by the time I divide it into four or five servings, it's not a whole lot. I even added a little more to the pan after I'd added the veggies because that was quite a lot of veggies. So I'm gonna get a substantial amount of zucchini and squash and carrots for a side dish to go along with the leftover tortellini. So I decided to try a different spice. I normally use Italian seasoning as my go-to, but I decided to try this Herb de Provence. I've had it before and it, it added something different. It's got like lavender in it, I think. And then I added some parsley, of course. And I think I also added basil. And I'm popping my leftovers into a container for meal prep, easy peasy, and I added the veggies. And so it was a save. I saved some items from the freezer that got used up, didn't go to waste, and even the veggies that I had last week. So this was a pantry meal, freezer meal, use it up meal, whatever you want to call it.